could a microgrid impact the future storms in New Jersey? I'm Jill Horner. This is Comcast Newsmakers. With me is Mayor Kevin Sedembrino. He's the mayor of Middletown Township. Thanks so much for being with us. Well, Jill, thank you for having me today. First of all, let's define a microgrid. This is something that you're looking into for your community. You want to assess the feasibility for Middletown Township, but what is a microgrid? So a microgrid is a distributed energy resource, or a DER, that uh, runs uh, parallel or islanded to the current grid, the current grid system. Uh, it provides backup power. Think about think of it as a big uh, generator uh, for your house, and it will be for all the critical infrastructure uh, in uh, the in the region, including the Naval Weapons Station Earl. So now, for you as a community, this could be particularly important when we think of the after effects of Superstorm Sandy. How could a microgrid uh, impact your community after a natural disaster, for example? So what the, what the microgrid will do is it will provide power immediately after there's a power failure uh, at the grid. Um, so it will be hardwired to each of the substations. Uh, so there will be no or little downtime with regard to any infrastructure for firehouses, uh, schools, and our new municipal building. And you mentioned the new municipal building, mm -hmm. but you also mentioned Naval Weapons Station. Earl, this would be the largest user of the power from the microgrid. That's correct. That's correct. And, and certainly of national importance. And that uh, makes this uh, feasibility study uh, one of the uh, more important ones in the state, uh, such that uh, it will have national importance and be a leader within the state to generate uh, backup power uh, instantly and, and sustainably as well. And you mentioned instantly and mm -hmm. sustainably, so this would be important uh, for critical infrastructure within your community, not just Naval Weapons Station Earl, but other uh, infrastructure within the community after a future storm. That's correct. It gives uh, it gives p uh, the residents of Middletown uh, locations to go uh, in, in place of a storm that will be fully packed. Uh, and we look uh, for the microgrid to be sustainably designed such that we can use uh, uh, solar, uh, solar power, uh, wind power, uh, battery uh, storage, uh, like at our municipal building, so that that can contribute uh, to the microgrid. Now, after Superstorm Sandy, power was out in some locations five days, a week or more. Would this have an impact, having a microgrid in place, getting power up faster? Yes, the, the, the power that we, uh, we did not get was not local power, wasn't generated locally. So the importance with regard to a microgrid is that the power gets generated locally and it is stored locally so we can access and tap into that power uh, faster and more reliably uh, than power that is not generated within the region. You have some preliminary findings from this study at this point. You're hoping to have a completed report by the end of the year, but talk to us a little bit about how this would be implemented. Who would actually put this microgrid in place? Would it be a public-private partnership, for example, or is that yet to be worked out? Sure. The, the ownership uh, models are yet to be worked out, and they can, they can run from a uh, public scenario to a public-private partnership to the utility company themselves actually owning uh, owning the microgrid. It would be a secondary source of uh, power for all of our inf infrastructure. And with this feasibility study, you're one of only 13 municipalities to undergo this study at this point, but you say for you as a township, this is critically important. Th this is critically important. Uh, so Middletown is the 16th largest municipality in the state. We were one of uh, 13 municipalities to receive a $150,000 grant. Uh, and uh, we, uh, at the end of the year, we'll complete that grant. Then, at the beginning of next year, we may uh, we look to be selected to be one of the um, municipalities that would uh, get uh, the grant to design, uh, start design for a microgrid, an actual microgrid. Thanks so much so. for being with us, Mayor. Thank you very much. My pleasure. We've been talking with Mayor Kevin Sedembrino of the Township of Middletown. I'm Jill Horner.